All right, so you know how to hurt Yuke, or Ook, and you know how to show in replay, but let's face it, that's too boring. You want to decapitate, you want to punch his change, punch him in half, and then punch him into pieces or something. Yeah, I can't do that. Sorry about that. But I can teach you how to punch something off. It now, like any Tory Bash Master would tell you, a noob, like you for example, practice makes perfect. At the start, you will just be doing it out of luck. It was like me, I, I could rarely decapitate his arm until I learned how to. You'll be doing it out of luck. But, as you, your skills improve, you shall learn the art of decapitation. What I was supposed to do is decapitate his arms off when I said that. But you can see I'm still learning, so don't blame me. You can see right there, that's decapitation. What I just did there is rip his head off with a series of movements from my legs, and abs, and arm. Now, the base now the basics of decapitation relies on how fast you're moving. You must be moving at faster than 30 ma 30 something, I don't know the measurement, but you move, must be moving really fast in order to decapitate. Any body part can, any body part you use can and or can be decapitated or decapitate someone. And, uh, your arms, legs can decapitate at any point. However, you must be moving fast. So if I were to extend my abs and contract both my arms, it be, it be that will not decapitate someone, because you can see, I am pretty slow. If I were to contract my abs, contract my pecs, and space, and then here if I were to lower, if I were to grab, um, Extend, contract both my hips and extend both an both ankles. Contract my knee. That will not decapitate. Why? I'm new. I'm moving so slow. I'm moving too f slow. I was just going to put on something. We are. <laughs> And push. So, but, 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 big but. If I hit C, uh, contract my left pec, extend my right pec, right rotate my chest, right bend lumbar, extend my left hip. Extend my right hip, extend both ankles, hit V to grab, and and then hit space here, and then after one space I contract both my wrist and elbow. That should have decapitated him. I have forgot to hit V, that's what happened. So you can see I'm not a I'm not a pro at this, but hey, at least I'm trying. And hey, at least you're learning. Look, if you can decapitate someone, you've just got enough huge step up in most in Tory Bash. If you learn how to decapitate someone perfectly every single time, you my friend are going places.
Yeah, no. Well, you saw at the start of this that I would manage to decapitate you in his head. That, I just snapped my wrist. So that was not a decapitation, I dismembered myself. That is one of the things you should avoid as well. Dismembering yourself. You can snap your ne own neck, and it is probably the worst thing ever to do. There's a simple decapitation, if I remember correctly. It requires by contracting both. Holding. If I do this incorrectly, correct me in the comments. Extend both hip. Extend both hips. Extend. Oh, that's going for his neck. Okay. Not good for him. Extend both glutes. And then, if I shift quickly, just slowly. Hit space once and shift. Contract both. Both elbows. His space. You can see the momentum going into that. But it didn't decapitate him. I wasn't fast enough. So I'll raise. Dead butt. And there, you can see, I've made a huge mistake and I've dismembered my own elbows. So, you want to avoid dismembering yourself. But how can you do that? You want to get a, a mi mid-range. You want to get at exactly 30 or 40. Exactly 30 or 40. It, if you do not, then, well, you're going to decapitate yourself. Which is not good. I, it's not healthy to decapitate yourself. Very, it's not healthy. Well, now there's no secret formula to decapitating someone. It's all just practice, really. As you can see, I suck at decapitating someone. It will be easier to decapitate someone in multiplayer because they are actually moving and you have more chances to, de to destroy them, say. But yeah, that's gonna be it for this, for this one. Subscribe to me if you want to see more gaming videos or if you want coding videos, I have those too. And if you like this, press the like button and I'll see you on the next video! Ooh.